Well, I've been keeping the title a mystery. I think the credit for that goes to the Amazon people here. They are very, very secretive about these things until the right launch comes. But uh, speaking about the show, I mean, uh, <laughs> we're super thrilled that uh, we're getting to do the Indian segment of the American show, Citadel. And uh, Arya loves the title. You get to make decisions. You, you get to determine the, you know, the, the moral direction your character goes in. For us, for the series, we needed three characters. To, to convey that idea. Um, Elle's character, Aaron's character, and Walt's character. And so we're going to show you a moment in episode two in which all three of these fascinating, dangerous characters first encounter each other. Fantastic. All right. Thank you, Mike. Thank you, Jonathan. Um, I'm going to like, we're going to take um, um, a step aside because I would like you to cue what's coming up. Like, we know you kick ass like no one else does. You're just so hot. But this was something else altogether. Varun, when did you become hot? <laughs> I try to learn from you, Karan, on a daily basis. <laughs> you, I mean, this was incredible. Like, I have to ask all of you. This was just fantastic. Listen, come on. I want to hear louder applause. Woo! That was amazing. Now, can we all have this team do a photo up for us, please? Thank you. These absolute maverick talents on our stage. Thank you. But don't just towards the center so they get the best view. Come close. Come close. Come close. Welcome. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you for joining us and have a good afternoon. Thank you. It's wonderful to meet you. Thank you. Give it up, ladies and gentlemen. I love how polite our paparazzi is for making the magic unfold. Joining Jonathan is Ella Brunel. Ella is a remarkable talent in the acting world, a rising British actress with a dynamic portfolio spanning film, television, and theater. She's making waves and set to captive audiences in her lead role as Lucy in the much-anticipated Amazon Prime video series, Fallout, premiering worldwide on the 11th of April. A big round of applause for Ella, okay, Lucy, please. I was walking along, minding my business. Ella, Jonathan, welcome to India. Is this your first time in our beautiful country? It is. It's my first time here. I'm very excited to be here. Uh, not the first time for me, but uh, we did come and shoot a few days on the Dark Knight Rises here. And unfortunately, there wasn't, uh, I wasn't able to make the trip, so this is long overdue for me to come back. Well, we're very glad to have you here. Welcome. And we can't wait to see you more and more often in our country. Thank you for being here. Uh, Jonathan, the world is eagerly waiting for Fallout. You already know that. That is not news to you. Uh, this series is based off, off one of the most popular video game franchises of all time. Give it up for Gaurav, ladies and gentlemen. Joining us now is the driving force behind Prime Video India, who's leaving no stone unturned to ensure Prime Video remains India's most loved entertainment destination. Sorry, but is Prime Video keeping you from sleeping? You know now that the one person to blame is this gentleman who's going to come out right now. Please welcome Sushant Sriram, Country Director, Prime Video India. Sushant, ladies and gentlemen, the stage is all yours. Thank you, Karan, and good afternoon, everyone. It's great to be here. Oh, very good afternoon, everyone. So, Sushant, I was thinking, from the moment we wake up every morning, there are a few questions that come to our minds. Well, there are many, Gaurav. Mike, welcome back. How does it feel? 
I know you've been, uh, uh, and I speak for all of us here, you've been here to our wonderful city before, but when I say you are so, when we are also excited to have you with us, I know that you've been, of course, to India for the first time. And, but we wanted a contrasting title, something that still represents a bit of quirk from us. So I thought, well, well, we thought it's a, it's, an, it's a term of Indian meant honey bunny. Uh, at the same time, the characters are also called honey and bunny. It's just fantastic. Now, Varun, uh, you could win the Student of the Year trophy, my apologies. But do you think you will be the legit spy of the year? Uh, what do you think will get the audiences to call you, therefore, the spy of the year? I think all they have to do is stream the show on Prime Video and uh, first of all, I, I'm just filled with so much gratitude today, I just want to say Welcome to Prime Video, Prime Video presents an epic event which has it all from gutsy creators to dashing superstars to breathtaking directors but enough about me. As some of you might remember, I was the host of the last Prime Video Presents as well. So if what you're experiencing right now is not deja vu, it's they just using me again. Because nothing, and you know nothing, screams showbiz like a sequel. For the uninitiated who are watching, it was uh, when I saw Family Man season 2, I actually picked up the call and I got DK on the phone. And uh, I told him I'm a big fan of your work. I said, how can I, you know, how can I be collaborate? How do I work with you? And he was like, okay, I can't tell you there's something secretive happening, but we're doing something with the Russos. I have to start by saying that I absolutely love the name of the show. It gives me an idea for a sequel to my film, well, Honey or Mummy, Keep Rain, Kahani, perhaps, whatever. <laughs> but what's the thought behind the name, Honey Bunny? Like, what was the thought behind it? I love it. But what are the audiences in for? We, as you saw, it's a, we kind of try to do something new each time, we challenge ourselves to do something. And of his stupendous body of work that includes Memento, The Dark Knight, Interstellar and Westworld. Today, Jonathan is here to give you a sneak peek into his much awaited next project. An original series set in the world of the Bethy Star's hit video game, all out for Prime Video. Give it up for the series director and executive producer. capture the heartbeat of Instagram. <laughs> yes, thank you. You all look incredible. Now just smile. Okay, Samantha doesn't want to be in the picture. And here we go. Pow! Just come a little ahead, please, ladies and gentlemen, if I might. Come closer, come closer. No, no, no. Yeti, yeah. Perfect. Come closer. Come closer. Come closer. Come closer. Come closer. Just snuggle up. Look center. Varun Sam. Varun Sam. Varun Sam. Varun Sam. All right, give it up for this incredible team of Citadel. Thank you. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. We're having a party. Varun Sam. Varun Sam. Thank you. Varun Sam. Sam, Sam. Sam, Sam. Varun. Varun sir, Varun Sam. Sam, Varun. Raj and DK, you can't go anywhere. I'm really sorry. You'll have to come right back. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> bye bye. Uh, 
Uh, Vijay, congratulations for this and thank you for joining us today. You, so you just won a Filmfare and an Asian Academy Creative Award for your performance in The Heart. Uh, seriously, is there a secret acting school that you go to that helps you master these great characters? We really want to know. How do you do it? Time and again, all the time. I, I really, I mean, I've been to an acting school, but I don't think there is any secret act, acting school that I went to. I think I learned more from the masters who worked before me, Dilip Saab, Bachchan Saab, Shah Rukh Sir, Irfan Khan. I like what Javier Pardhan once said. He said, I don't believe in God, I believe in Al Pacino. <laughs> I really didn't think that I could do it. I didn't think that I would be a part of this, of Citadel and Honey Bunny. I, and I'm just in, extremely grateful to Raj. D I can't tell you. And then, I think he remembered, I called him, I reached out to him. And this happened. And also to have this special day happen with uh, Mr. Karan Johar on stage means the world to me.